What's up, LNS fam? This is Manuel. And my name is Farlan. And welcome to another video of Lifestyle and Sneakers. Today, we're gonna be doing a carpool review, sneaker review actually, of the Yeezy 700 V3 Azael. So let's go! So guys, now we're holding the Yeezy 700 V3 Azael. So this sneakers was released last year, uh, 2019, December 23 of 2019 to be exact. However, it was not released, uh, I'm not sure if it was released worldwide, but just in particular uh, sneaker shops. It was not released here in the Philippines. Um, I think in Asia it was not released. It was only released in the US and uh, Europe, if I'm not mistaken. But yeah. So th this is a very limited sneakers. Yeah, so far it's a very li for Asian, limited. Maybe for Asia. Yeah. For not not for Asia, for for Americas. For the America. Sorry, guys, I'm driving. We're we're trying to do a, so this a is review for yeah, while I driving. I mean, it's limited for us. Yeah, there limited for us, us because we we did have we a did, release. Yeah, we didn't we, have we, a did, release. we didn't have a release here in the Philippines. But hopefully, we're gonna have a release soon. Uh, uh yeah, a, uh, restock or a restock of these. But normally, Easy does that. Like, uh, they will initially release um, on certain parts of the world. And then they will do a restock, mm -hmm. uh, including the rest of the world, like what they did with uh, Clay's. Uh -huh. Initially, it was uh, an American exclusive, and then after a few months, they also released it uh, worldwide. Oh, okay. yeah. So uh, let's start with the shoes. Yeah. First, uh, the upper. So this one has a lot of materials. Yes. So the base material is. Uh, there's a, a mesh, a, a synthetic mesh, mesh here mm. in this area, in the arch. Uh, it's actually see-through. Uh, yeah. so, see-through. So if you wear colored socks, you will definitely see it. Then above that, I, I think this is, is this a knit or, uh, or a like, mesh? It's like a... It's like a mesh. It's not a knit. Really? The, the upper, the black part? No, no, no. This one. This, uh, this one. one. It's, it's mesh. It's mesh with uh, stri a stripe pattern. Yes. Then you have a neoprene kind of material for the for the tongue here. Mm -hmm. And then on top of that, there's a exoskeletal yeah, exoskeletal TPU uh, fused uh, uh, material here, which is uh, glow in the dark. Oh, glow in the dark. Yes, this oh, one okay. is glow in the dark. So right now, it's the color is like. Uh, a cream color yeah but but glows in the dark yeah i have tried it already and oh. it really glows and i got really excited okay oh, now on the like there's there's an inner part and uh, this is the outer part mm -hmm. then the inner part inside that exoskeletal uh, it's like a a boot sock a boot a like sock construction yeah. Yeah. yeah it's a boot like so it's made out of like a neoprene kind of material and there's 3m inside here yes 3m on this this and this so basically, these sneakers have a glow-in-the-dark materials, and it also has 3M materials. Now the ankle area, the tongue area is uh, lightly padded, so it's there's uh, softness or comfort there. Mm -hmm. Then there's uh, the lace loops under the exoskeleton. Yeah, hidden, hidden, hidden. over here. For the midsole, it's a uh, it's a different midsole actually. Yeah, a Inside. Different. Outside, so, I'm not sure what it's called. It's just a casing, a EVA, rubber casing. Uh, uh, EVA, EVA foam casing. Yeah, it's it's soft. It's almost similar to the rubber casing of the Yeezy 380 Alien. Yeah, it's soft and smooth. Yeah. Now, uh, the, inside of that, there's a... It's not boost. It's not boost. First uh, time for color, the 700 to not have boosts. It's color blue, but uh, it's still soft. Yeah, it's, it's actually really soft as well. Uh, Feel, actually, sure. it feels like boost also, but uh, there's Flat no boost. <laughs> yeah, but it's not like the a styrofoam, uh, styrofoam uh, texture to it. Yes. but it's it feels like it feels soft and bouncy. Yeah, I'm Almost not really like sure uh, what is the exact name of the yeah. the midsole. This one, the hidden part. However, um, 
it's definitely not boost and it's almost but it's almost the same comfort yeah. as the boosts almost the same softness yeah now uh, for the outsole you have uh, it's actually this almost the same as the yeah, 700 the, right the, the usual north, 700 but it has smaller holes and uh, more of them oh yeah so there's a lot of uh, holes that you can see the yeah this the one has through. nine one two three four oh ten mm -hmm. it has ten holes that you can see the the material the cushioning system inside so then yeah. you have the rubber outsole this one is in the, in the normal the, herringbone yeah, pattern herringbone pattern but the color is light blue well, it's light blue yeah or, yeah something like that light blue so now uh, on so now what can you say about this sneaker yeah I'm I'm actually speechless I actually like it in fact um, for me this is like the best 700 mm. aesthetic wise because it's futuristic I like futuristic stuff um, on feet I'm not sure yet you haven't tried it I haven't yet. tried it on feet how about the the insole the insole is ortho light ah okay just your um, typical uh, EC 700 uh, yeah. insole ortho light so I think I, I've seen people wear these and it looks good um, however of course it depends on the person wearing it so I'm not sure yet if it will look good on me however this is definitely one of the best I must say I like it better than the V2 mm -hmm. the V1 I think it's almost the same because I like the V1s simply because of its um, the vibe it gives it, it's more of like a, a retro vibe right the 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 v1s the v2 it was it looks futuristic but it's like it's not enough mm. this one really looks futuristic yeah. yeah for me this one looks really like futuristic and ahead of it uh, ahead of its time so you, you cannot see uh, any shoe like this similar to this yes. one so if you want to be Very like uh, different yeah if you want to be unique different so i think this is the shoe for you uh for me i like it a lot as well so because it's very different mm -hmm. and stands out so uh, of course the limited nature of this sneaker gives it uh More give, premium. yeah gives it this uh it's a uh, desirability but uh, yeah. for me it looks good and uh, I, I think i might i might uh, get one for my own uh, there's actually uh, another colorway that will be dropping soon it's a triple black colorway oh, okay. which, which is called so I, the alva okay i think i saw that but uh, i think this one will look, look but the only problem with this one that i noticed is that it gets dirty or it's a dirt magnet because this actually this particular sneakers got stuck in customs mm -hmm. and finally uh, I was happy that I finally got it but when I got it there's a lot of hand marks or uh, fingerprints so meaning when the customs officer was ex inspecting these <laughs> yeah. probably their hands are dirty and yeah I, I can see their hair their fingerprints uh, okay. so meaning it's easy to it's uh, get be, dirty yeah it's gonna be hard to like uh, do other colorways on this one yeah, I think this one is, is I think if they will I'm not sure I will, I'm, I'm trying to picture it like if the midsole is the same and then the exoskeletal is black I think that would be great as well I know I'm not sure what do you think I think the, I think the colorway in this one is like really good yeah I, I like the colorway definitely this one I, I'm, similar to the the basketball yeah basketball. yeah it has actually this one the alien and the easy basketball has the same vibe mm -hmm. so i think uh yeezy is uh going, going towards, towards that, that direction. direction yeah more futuristic and uh, like really um changing everything yeah so they're done with the the classic look and now they're trying to do a uh, more uh, futuristic, futuristic or, vibe uh, alien alien life actually they, they should have called this alien because this one looks more alien than the alien yeah. right yeah this one looks more alien especially with the the, the glow in the dark features yeah, it's a it, yeah it, it really looks more of an alien compared to the the easy 380 alien 
So anyway, what's the retail price of this one? The retail price of this one is 220 US dollars. So it's cheaper than the 700s, the yeah. normal 700s. Yeah. Because uh, if you don't know, the normal 700s is at 300. 300 US dollars. So this is only a 220, if I'm not mistaken, 230. Two, 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 uh, 220 or 230. Initially, it was supposed to be oh, no. Sorry, sorry, sorry. This was only. This is only two hundred dollars. Ah, okay. It was initially um, priced at one eighty uh, on the in initial leaks, but then they changed it to two hundred. Because there's no boost. There's no boost, so it was two. It is two hundred. The two. The two thirty is the three eighty alien. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, but actually, the retail price or sorry, the resale price of these already went up. It's, uh, I think you can get this now at my size, size 10 or 10.5, about 500 US dollars already. So you won't get it at 200, so the price already more than double. Of course, since it's an OG colorway of the... It's not gonna go down. Yeah, it's not gonna unless, go down. Unless they, uh, they do a massive uh, restock. Yes. Yeah. But normally, even though they do a massive restock, like for example for the Wave Runners, Runners, it's still one of the most expensive colorway. They've done so many restock of the Wave Runners. Um, but yeah, definitely this one uh, is one of the most expensive 700s to date. So at 500 price now. And uh, one of the reasons, yes, because of its uh, limited, limited, nature. Yeah, limited nature. So yeah, uh, guys, um, do you like the 700 VDs? I've seen a lot of comments during our mega unboxing that this is the best from all the, the sneakers that I unboxed um, that time. But if you haven't watched that video yet, please do so. I'll be putting up the link. And uh, yeah, that's about it. This is the Yeezy 700 V3 as I am. So Freud, anything that we need to tell our viewers? Okay, if you like uh, this video, please press the thumbs up button down below. And if you haven't subscribed to our channel, subscribe now. Yes, and we have, and also we want to inform you that we have ongoing giveaways. We actually have two ongoing giveaways. The, the first one, we're giving away up to four Yeezy 380 Alien. Oh, up and to four. Yes, up to four. And the second giveaway, we're giving out up to 400 US dollars worth of sneaker shopping. All you need to do is check out the description box down below. So please uh, read the description box, follow all the mechanics so you'll have a chance to uh, win one of our giveaways. And also please uh, like us on Facebook, follow us on Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, TikTok. Again, my name is Froyland. This is Manuel. Until next time.